Tulsa Air and Space Museum and Planetarium is a place where imaginations soar. I feel like I'm a pilot and it makes me feel like I'm in charge. A trip to the museum includes this 40,000 square foot hangar packed with many one-of-a-kind aircraft, like this Spartan Executive Model 12. Only one was created. It actually flew in here for you know its last flight before it became a permanent artifact here in our museum, and it's one of our favorites. The museum celebrates Tulsa's rich oil and gas and aviation history. It ranges from things from World War I uh, all the way through World War II, through the era of Tulsa being the oil capital of the world, all the way into modern times when there was a lot of components of the Saturn rocket and the space shuttle built right here in Tulsa. Amazing, pretty much. It's, I like seeing all the planes and just cool. And there are plenty to see, like this F-14, made popular in the film Top Gun. One of the things that we do is we let them climb into the Ranger and use the foot pedals and the volunteers explain to them, this is how you steer a plane is with your feet, with the feet pedals. It makes me feel like I want to like actually do something with them, like flying. There are numerous hands-on activities for the whole family, like a shuttle launch, hot air balloon simulator, and robotic space arm. John Harrington, Oklahoma Zone, Chickasaw Nation astronaut, actually tried it out for us and he says it works just like the real thing. You'll also find the original cast iron door frames from Tulsa Municipal Airport here. All of the aviation greats, from Amelia Earhart to Charles Lindbergh to Wiley Post, walked through these door frames. So if a family wanted to visit the museum, they have a lot of options to choose from. They can come into the exhibit hall and have a self-guided tour, but we also have docents available at any time to lead a tour and answer any questions. And be sure to leave time to check out the Air and Space Museum's recently upgraded planetarium. It's the most technically advanced around. This system that we use here has 10,000 years of history in it, and it has 10,000 years in the future in it and it has a half a billion objects in its database. I can go show you what the night sky looked like over the town where you were born on the day and night where you were born. Where else would you find that? The planetarium's huge dome is 50 feet in diameter. So as you sit back and relax, the show is all around you. We have a surround sound system of five channels, 10,000 watt stereo system, and the videos are stunning. Our laser projector is crisp, the colors are saturated beautifully, and the images are just clear and sharp, and the experience is one that people just actually get into. The planetarium has 110 seats and more than a dozen shows in its library. Listings and show times are found on the museum's website. It's really cool, like, it feels like you're actually in a spaceship or something, and it feels like magical or something. It feels like you're moving, and like, not just the screen. It's very fun. The Tulsa Air and Space Museum and Planetarium, a family adventure that's out of this world. It's something that um, you would never really see anywhere else. In Tulsa, I'm Julie Chin, Discovering Oklahoma.